Thousands of Perth Air passengers were stranded at the airport overnight when their flights were grounded by thick fog. Aviation experts say the delays can't be helped because anti-fog technology is too expensive. Chaos at Perth Airport this morning. Hundreds of tired passengers stuck in the terminal. 45 flights cancelled or delayed. Inbound and outbound, domestic and international, all affected as a thick blanket of fog covered the city. We were told that it was delayed by seven hours and we'd be getting on a flight at 7.30 and now we've been told to pick up our bags and go home and we'll be cold. Well, we arrived here about 10.30. So we've been here uh, what, a good eight hours. eight hours, seven hours. We started off uh, from Dunsville this morning at um, four o'clock, real thick fog. The Bureau of Meteorology says it expected the foggy conditions, but they rolled in earlier than usual. The disruptions first started at around 9.30 last night when the fog really started to settle in. These passengers are functioning on very little sleep and some have been waiting at the airport for more than eight hours. Air traffic controllers deemed the conditions too dangerous to fly, with visibility on the runway just 100 metres. Flights resumed at 4.30am when rain cleared the sky. Airports overseas use special anti-fog technology which allows pilots to take off and land in bad conditions. But aviation experts say Perth won't get the system. Bad weather's too rare and the technology too expensive. If we do install it at Perth Airport, uh, invariably it would become another operating tax that would go onto the airline ticket that you pay for. Luckily Perth should be fog free tonight and tomorrow morning. El Mitteros, Nine News.